In this chapter, we are going to learn how to create an event on Facebook page. So right now we are on Strikers India Facebook brand page. The other page Strikers Fitness was created recently. So in that page right now we are not having rights to create event. So I will show you the entire process how you can plan an event on Facebook page. If your business is planning some kind of physical event then definitely you should take that event to Facebook page as well. That will help you increase brand awareness, increase event awareness, increase engagement among your followers as well as potential customers. Depending on the nature of your business you can plan various kind of events. If you are an author you can plan a book launch event. If you are into education industry you can plan on career guidance seminar event. If you are restaurant bakery you can plan some kind of uh, new product launch event. So a lot of possibilities are there. But how to schedule that on Facebook? Let's see that. So we'll scroll over here and under this create we'll click on event. Over here we can see two types of events. One is online and one is in person. So online is more of a video event. We'll talk about this in next chapter. Right now we are focusing on in person. Get together with people at specific location. This is the event composition box where on left hand side we'll give the data and it will be visible over here in right hand side as in preview mode. So the first thing we have to give is event name. So we'll say it kids yoga training. The moment I have given this name, it is visible over here. Second thing we have to decide on the dates. So I will select 21st June and instead of evening, I will select something in morning that would be let's say 10 a.m. and the end date would be on the same day if we are starting at 10 i would end the event at 11 so on 21st june i want to plan this event for kids of one hour if we click on recurring event we'll see a lot of options like frequency daily weekly custom depending on the nature of your business you can plan daily weekly or uh, fortnightly kind of events but right now i'm going for this particular date and time so i will click on cancel so this way my event will be on 21st June 10 to 11 morning. Now over here I need to add description so my target audience can have a clear idea what is going to happen in this event. So here is the description everyone wants to be happy and healthy blah blah things and the moment I add this description it would be visible over here under the details section. Now I need to select the category for this event. There are a lot of uh, options, social issue, comedy, crafts. So out of this, I will select fitness and workout. Now I will click next and it will ask me to add a location. So we have already created a location, strikers, fitness. So we'll click this and select the location. The moment we select this, the map will be added in this area with the pin dropped at the location. I will click next. And over here we can see this image is coming from my Facebook cover page. I don't want this image to be a cover of my event. So I will delete this and upload a new cover photo for this particular event. So this is the image which I am going to use for my event cover page. Now over here in admission section, if you click, you will find this ticket URL. If this event is going to be chargeable, then you need to give the URL from where people can buy a ticket. Alternatively, what you can do, you can prepare a Google form and share the link over here. That way people will click for ticket, they will submit the data and ultimately you give them free access, but you will have certain data for marketing purpose. So right now I am not having any ticketing mechanism, so I will click cancel. Under this event settings, there are a few things which can help you increase the 
participation in this event so first is co-host co-host is somebody a page or a friend to whom you give a rights to invite his or her friends so let me type tell Bhavik I will select this now he will be a co-host I can have multiple co-host I can add Deepak so I have added Deepak as the second co-host now you will see this is pending both of them will get a notification they need to accept this co-host invitation then they would be able to invite their friends to this event over here you can see show guest list is by default turn on you should always turn this on in this way when your friend is participating in this event and your another friend looks at this particular uh, post then he would be seeing abc is going to this event that way you can influence the decision of your friend like if one of your friend is going to that event there are chances your second friend would attend that event over here we can see only admins can post an event i would recommend don't uh, you know turn this on because that would be only one way communication and i want your event should be seen as an engagement tool so people should be allowed to post on this uh, particular event page but always turn on this post must be approved by a host or co-host so that way you would be having surety that okay anything and everything is not posted on your event page you will go for moderation once you approve then only that content will be visible on the event page let people ask you a question about this event over messenger yes i want people to interact with me so i will turn on this now i will click save and everything is ready we can see the preview over here if we click this mobile icon then we will be seeing the how it is going to look on mobile devices so everything is ready now we'll publish this event now the event has been published over here we'll see all kind of uh, data about this events what is happening how many people have reached what are the responses what is the audience if there is any ticket sale and all kind of things can be analyzed from here now let me visit this as a person from here i can decide okay i am interested or not let me click going if i want to invite someone i can always do that now let's go back to our page and we can see one response because i clicked going to this event right now let's go back to our page so now we are back on our page and we can see this post and here we can see one going is written over here so as we get more response we would be saying okay five going 10 interested this way engagement will increase on this page you can plan number of events at the same time there is no restriction on that so i hope the step by step process is very clear how you can create an event on your facebook page so plan some event on your page if you find any difficulty do let me know and see you in the next video